All right, we're continuing talking about uh, volume, okay? And it says solving word problems about vol uh, liquid volume. So let's do something like this. All right. Uh, just that here, here's a start. It says Doug stacks 27 books in three piles. How many books are there in each pile? I know, it, I know, I know. It doesn't have this. Doesn't have to deal with volume or anything. So it's just a uh, a little problem to get your, you know, the blood flowing in your brain. <laughs> How do you know? How'd you get nine? So, yeah, so this would be a division problem, correct? All right. Okay, so here's our, our uh, problem for uh, for today. Okay, this is let's make a sense of the problem. Okay, so obviously we're talking about volume, right? And what's the liquid? Lemonade. Lemonade. Yeah. And and what and and what measurements? Yeah. Liters. So Maria has a cooler full of eight liters just like the video sweet so here's her uh cooler and it has it has eight liters right Hold on. Okay, so it has a uh, okay. So Mar Maria has a has a cooler that has um, eight liters, right? She wants to put the lemonade in into pitchers, okay, to uh, place on the tables at her party. Each pitcher holds two liters. So each section is one is is a liter. So there should be eight of them, right? Like that. So then there's, whoops. Sorry, let me try to do that perfectly. There we go. So there's eight total, okay? Okay, I, each pitcher can only hold two liters. So there's two, 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 okay, or something like this, okay. So you can use a model to show you, which exactly just like I did, right? See, two, four, two, four, six, eight. So each each section is has two liters. Each little section right here is only one. So there's two, four, six, eight. The whole um, cooler is eight liters. Okay, I need to divide those eight liters into pictures that hold how many liters? Yeah. Two. And here they are. Each picture holds two liters. The pictures need to hold eight liters of lemonade at all. Okay. It says, how does a picture of the cooler and, and, and picture it show you how many liters of the lemonade uh, are full? <laughs> Of lemonade, a full cooler can hold. Well, by the yellow lines, it tells me how many how many liters this uh, the the cooler holds, right? And I can just count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Uh, what do you need to do to find the number of pictures uh, Maria needs? What operation do we use? Count by twos, yes. Okay, until you get eight, and, that, and then you can see how many fingers you have. Okay, what is that so called? I got eight liters. I'm going to put two in each one. What am I doing? Dividing. Dividing. Okay, eight divided by two equals four, and that's how you know how many pictures you, you'll need. That says write a division equation uh, using P for the unknown. Okay, so how, how many liters total do, does she have? Eight, and she was divide. She was gonna divide how many how, how many liters? Two. I need to use the letter P for the unknown. Okay, write a multi multiplication equation. Well, do the opposite. I'm gonna go P times two equals eight.
Perfect. All right, go to page 630. It says, how much less water is in the second container than the first container? Well, how much is in the first one right here? 150. 150. Right? How much is in the second one? 100. It goes by five, so it's five, ten. So it's 115. The other one. Each loaded line is five, by the way. And then now I need to subtract, right? Because it says how many less, that means to subtract. Zero minus five, can I do that? Yeah. Nope. Bar from this five, that makes it a four. Instead of a zero, I get 10. 10 minus five is five. And four minus one is three. One minus one is zero. So uh, how much less water does the second container hold than the first one? 35. 35 what? Liters. So it's 35 like this with a capital L. Okay. Okay, Ethan has seven pitchers. Each pitcher contains three liters of water. How much water does Ethan have in all? What am I doing? Well, really? Okay, first of all, do I know the total yet? The total is how much water does Ethan have in all? Do I know how much water does he have in all? No, I don't. So I don't know the total. So it can't be division. Okay. Just by just by doing what it says. How many how many pitches does he have? Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? And how many uh, how many uh, liters of water in each in each pitcher? Three. Three. One, two, three, 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 one, two, three. One, two, three. Yes? Okay. And they just count how many have all together, right? Okay. Or what else could I do? Seven times three. Seven times three. Equals what? Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Are you going to do number eight by yourself? It says Leo needs twelve liters of juice for a party. How many two-liter bottles of juice should he buy? It says how many two-liter bottles, correct? So I need to make groups of two. two. Let's do this. Okay. One group. That's two. Three, four. Five, six. Seven, eight. Nine, ten. 11, 12. Okay. Or what would be my division problem? 12 divided by 2 equals what? 6. Six because how many groups do I have? 6 of them. So how many 2 liter bottles should he buy? 6. Just by reading the instructions, it will help you. All right. We're going to continue now with uh, session 4. I still lesson 28 liquid volume, understand liquid volume, okay? So it says, look at the container provided. So let's say this is my container, okay? Okay, provided, and now contains one liter of water. So let's say if, if this is just one liter of water right here. Okay, one liter of water, and I'll do blue. Okay. Estimate how much water the container can hold when full. So based on what I just drew, let me do it again. It makes it a lot better. So let's see if I had this. 
just based on this, huh, and and that blue section is one liter. Okay, how many liters would it, would it take to fill it all all the way up? What do you think? Three, five. Okay, so this seed one, about three, maybe four, but about three, right? You're just estimating. Do I need an, an exact one? No. So look at the example. It says Bella needs to prepare uh, containers of water, just like the, the, the one shown. How many liters of water uh, will Bella need to prepare seven? such containers okay it says each container uh holds 10 liters of water perfect but she needs seven of them right so obviously seven times 10 will be 70 perfect let's do this one together it says perry has three large barrels that contain water he uses to water his garden to, on dry days so how many barrels does he have three three okay just read every each sentence of the word problem to help you out. Don't just start solving the problem without it. So if, if I'm drawing or if I'm writing, what are you supposed to be doing? Right. <laughs> so three large barrels, right? Three large barrels. After a recent storm, one barrel held how many liters? One barrel? 186. Okay, one held how many liters? 203. And the other one held how many liters? 190. It says, how many liters of collected rain does Perry have in all? What am I doing? I'm adding. So take 186, 203, 190. And I add six plus three plus zero is nine. Not eight plus zero is eight plus eight plus nine is 17. Put the seven down and carry the one. Okay, one plus two is three, plus one more is four, plus the one that I carried is five. So how many liters does he have in all? 579. So you're gonna have problems like similar to this tomorrow, okay? It says, Jason keeps his turtle uh, in a tank that holds 20 liters of water. He keeps his frog in a tank that holds 10 liters of water. How much greater is the volume of the turtle tank than the frog tank? Actually, what am I doing? Subtracting. Subtracting. I wanna know the difference, right? And difference means to subtract. Okay, 20 minus 10. What would it be? 10, 10 obviously. I'm not adding, even though there's 30 liters. It doesn't say in all, right? Okay. We're at 635, where number four says, this pot contains one liter of water, which is the best estimate. So you just kind of an educated guess. What is the best estimate for how many liters the pot can hold? What do you think? Okay, hold on. So this is one, right? Okay. Two should be about right here. So about about roughly how many how many liters would it hold when it's full? Three. There's three sections. Obviously, it needs two more liters to fill it up, right? But it says which is the best estimate for how many liters the pot can hold when it's full okay so you're right it's three gonna do number five so what operation am i am i doing division because how many liters of water do i she has noah has eight, eight. okay and we're going to divide those liters into four flower beds so eight divided by four is two. two. It says how many liters of water does he use on each flower bed? He uses two liters of water. 
Okay, or you can do two capital L like that. All right. It says, how many liters of water in total are these containers holding? In total. Oh, and then each one of these is 10. So it goes 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, and then 100. So it goes 100, 110, 120, 130. So this is 130. This guy right here. The first one's 130. And then this next one is how much? 30, 40, 50. This one's on the next one's 150. So what would be the total? 280. Yes, because I'm just adding, right? Zero plus zero is zero. Three plus five is eight. And then one plus one is two. Excellent.